All right, folks, check it out, you Star Wars fans out there. We're going to get three by three. We got nine different uh, cards from the original 1977 trading uh, card series from Topps. Lots of goodies right here, so let's jump right into them. First off, we'll give you a size marker so you see their rough size. Typical trading card size. And these were produced uh, in conjunction with the movie so that you could trade uh, different scenes. That's why they're all from this first uh, movie, A New Hope. Uh, each one either contains a nice little uh, close-up shot or a scene from the movie. So what I'm going to do here is this is the condition report, so we will show you the condition of each of the cards. The best way we found to do that is to let the light shine on it right there. So if there's any... Uh, imperfections, flaws, gouges, scratches, tears, etc. You're going to see them. We couldn't possibly hide them from you. Um, and then you'll be able to see the corners as well, if any are gummed up or anything like that. And finally, what we'll do is when we put them back down, you'll be able to see the back. Many of them have these, uh, uh, basically a puzzle, but they form a giant poster. So there you go. And we'll start doing through that way. Luke and Han in the refuse room. As you recall, one of the more exciting scenes. Or one of the more gross scenes, whichever one you want to pick. No real flaws on it right there that we can see. Nice little movie facts on the back. We always like to see those. There's a nice little buddy film right here. You got Luke and or uh, C3PO rather and R2D2. Like a weird buddy cop movie right there. And some more of the same on the back, the governor of Imperial Outlands. I don't think I've ever uh, heard him referenced in that way before, but there you go. Um, obviously, some of this uh, were taken from earlier production pieces. So some of the copy for this was was. Uh, written before the movie premiere, changes get made during the production. So are they calling them the Sand People because that's what they want to call them? Or are they, did they not yet have a name? Were they not yet the Tusken Raiders? I don't know. Up to you. A nice little Bantha right there. Bantha fans. Day of Rejoicing. Go. If you like this scene, you'd get a chance to see it again a few years later at the end of uh, Conan the Barbarian 2. Conan the Destroyer, I should say. They had basically the same scene, but with more comedy. Good stuff there. Hey, look at that. Already you've got a match. So if you get a whole bunch of these lots that we're offering in our next auction, you might be able to put that together and have a neat little uh, poster. Here's some more stuff going on in the uh, in the trash compactor. Steel walls close in on our heroes. Looking pretty good right there. Obviously, before the uh, the Dianaga. Some repairs for C-3PO. Like father, like son. Got Luke there working on his little hobby kit. Well, his dad's old hobby kit, I suppose. <laughs> Spoiler alert. And I like this poster. These are fun. These are neat. The uh, the 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 stills from the thing. Uh, but these I like. This old early concept art. Does that go together? I think it might. Eh, maybe not. And then finally, Space Pirate on Solo. I suppose that's accurate. A little weird. And maybe they were going for... He does even wear like a swashbuckler's outfit. I never quite noticed that. And again, early uh, early work would have... kind of replied or uh, re referred to him as that. If, uh, Charlie Lippincott would have been working on some of, the, uh, some of this right here, putting out that production material, the uh, promotional stuff. So there you have it. Lots of goodness right here. Maybe these two. Do these two go together? Let's try it. Nope, not even close. Oh, but what about this? 
Oh, now we got something. Here it is. For, oh, look at this. Oh, no, no, I'm wrong. Anyway, <laughs> hours of fun for you out there. Uh, you can put these together, do this. You get enough of these lots, you're bound to get uh, the full set. And you can do that over at thebigtoyauction.com. Head on over there right now. You can leave your pre-bids on all these items. You can look at the photos. You can ask questions. You can read the descriptions, etc. Uh, either way, we look forward to seeing you at the auction.